Do you know your iPhone has a shortcut that can protect you during a traffic stop? It's called I am getting pulled over and today I will show you exactly how to download it, set it up and use it all in under 5 minutes. Our first question is what is I am getting pulled over? This is an iPhone shortcut that activates when you say Siri I am getting pulled over. It can pause your music, dim your screen, send your location to your contacts and start recording a video. This helps protect your rights and keep your loved ones informed. Okay, before proceeding, I just want to make sure that for some of the iPhone lower version, we have to go to settings. In the settings, we have to search for shortcuts. Just go ahead and open up the shortcuts. And here, if you go to advanced, you will find an option allow untrusted shortcuts. Just go ahead and toggle that untrusted shortcuts on first. I don't have that option here, so I'm just going back. Now in the next step, we have to download the shortcut that says I'm getting pulled over. Let me search for Safari browser here. Once you are in the Safari browser, just go ahead and paste the link given in my video description and tap the go button. You can see here, I'm getting pulled over in the shortcut apps. If you see at the left top of your screen, just go ahead and tap on open. Now my iPhone is asking me that, do you want to add, hey Siri, I'm getting pulled over to run and appear in the share sheet? Yeah, let me go ahead and tap on add shortcut. Now under all shortcut, we have the option, I'm getting pulled over. Let me go back completely and here we want to find shortcuts on our iPhone. Let's tap on it. Okay, once this shortcut is added, let me go and tap on these three dots. You will see that what this shortcut will do. It's gonna receive images and more input from share sheet. And then if there is no input, this will continue to send a message. I got pulled over. I can't call or text right now but i will get in touch after it's over next you can see we would be able to add the recipient and we could go ahead and enable to show when run the next option we have it will get location so currently shortcut does not have access to the location we have to go ahead and allow the location and then it will be going to send the current location it will turn on the do not disturb until turned off manually the next we could see here that it will take a video with front camera and it will save in videos and recent in any case of emergency then again it will turn on do not disturb and that could be turned off manually. We have reviewed all of the setting and if you want, you could just go ahead and add any of your required setting here. Let's go ahead and tap on done. Once I tap on, I'm getting pulled over shortcut. This is asking me that allow I'm getting pulled over to send a message. Let's tap on allow. So when we tap on it or when we allow it, we have to add the emergency recipient contact to whom this will send the video, this will send the message, this will send the location when you are in any emergency or you will get pulled over, right? And if you want, you could just go ahead and add any actions or if you want to remove any actions from here, you could go ahead and tap on this cross icon that will remove the actions from here. And also, if you want to edit the message, that message Siri is going to send to the recipient, you could go ahead and edit it from here. You could go ahead and add more than one recipient here, right? Or if you want to change or update the recipient, you will be able to do like this way and then just tap on done. Now it's time to try. Hey Siri, I'm getting pulled over. You'll need to turn on location services for that. Want to turn it on just this once or while using Siri. The I am getting pulled over shortcut is more than a cool iPhone trick. 
It's a tool that helps protect your safety, your privacy, and your peace of mind in high pressure moments. Make sure it's set up correctly and tell your friends and family about it. If you found this tutorial helpful, do me a favor. Subscribe to ITPK for more simple, real world tech tutorials like this one. Leave a comment if you need help and stay safe out there. Take care. Bye.